at 8 o'clock. An iconic house in La Jolla is now on the market for a bargain 30, 30 million dollars. Can borrow some money? <laughs> Heather Lake takes us inside the Razor home. It seriously looks like we're on the set of a movie. If you've never heard of the Razor House, well, we're giving you a look inside. $30 million and on the market. And the ladies who are going to tell us all about this crazy piece of architecture are right here. I've got Lale and Nilu, both with Caldwell Banker, uh, partners, sisters, and now getting to show off this fabulous piece of property. How are you? I'm doing well. I'm a uh, pleasure to uh, introduce this wonderful home uh, to you and your vi viewers. This is so cool. So glass everywhere. And if it's not glass, it's this really cool concrete. When someone walks into this house, what's their uh, initial reaction? They're wild. They're wild by the scenery of the Pacific Ocean and the white um, concrete and the glass of this structure. It was finished in 2007 and uh, architect uh, Wally Cunningham was the designer of the, uh, this uh, wonderful property and uh, the house was finished by 2007 uh, but uh, the current owner continued uh, addition of the living space and uh, library uh, to, so that uh, the house would be more appropriate for a wider audience. Yeah, maybe someone could even live here if they wanted to. Let's walk and talk through this property because it's really interesting how the layout is. Uh, there's a guest house that people could stay in. Maybe I'll just move in. <laughs> I don't think they would mind. Um, but everything's set up so there's clean lines uh, and, and places to live, places to party, and places to entertain. This right here is a hidden bar. I want up so people can see what was the um, owner trying to do here they wanted to uh, ha preserve the look so when you walk in you don't see a bar which uh, the architect thought uh, resembles a drinker in the house uh, but at the same time have all the beverages available for um, yeah, somebody. Yeah, they've got this available. They've got, I don't know, a mini wine cellar over here. So I'm sure this is a, an entertainer's wonderful place to live. Let's walk and talk some more because I want people to see. This is only one floor. How many floors? How many square feet are we talking about? Four floors oh, wow. and uh, 12,000 square feet. The elevator shaft that we're looking at right here. Uh, I want people to be able to see everything. So sorry for walking so fast, but to be able to show off this beautiful space, we kind of have to get around. Um, it almost looks like a museum, right? Because everything's so untouched. I have children at home, so I always <laughs> see white couches and get scared. But this is so gorgeous. The views are insane. How many bedrooms? How many bathrooms? Uh, there's a total of six bedrooms and six full baths and two powder rooms and a movie theater. A movie theater. How wonderful. Um, behind us is probably just one of the kitchens, right? <laughs> uh, yes, there are two kitchens. One an entertaining kitchen with a lot of sitting space and then a prep kitchen in the back with all the proper appliances for the chef to and if you have And if you have $30 million cash, you can just come in, say hi to one of you ladies, and this could be your home. Yes, 30 <laughs> cool million dollars will buy you this wonderful property. I better start saving. All right, I'm going to leave you ladies down here. I'm going to make my way up to my bedroom, right? Uh, show you the ocean views from up here. If you want more information on the Razor House, yes, the house has a name. The Razor House almost looks like Tony Stark's mansion. Go to fox5sandiego.com. All you have to do oh, is click on the scene on tab not a bad way to start the work week. Okay. I'm going to get cozy. I'll send it back to you guys.